today we're talking about earth system science and biology plays a huge role in the earth systems, especially plant biology and photosynthesis. The sunlight comes in and some of that energy is captured in carbon dioxide and some of that energy it strikes a green leaf and also water leaves the leaf and there's a lot of uh, energy transfer to evaporating water so the, the photosynthesis cools the planet a huge amount and stores uh, sunlight as chemical energy in the form of uh, carbohydrates in the, the food that we eat and in the uh, material that makes up plants now that's called net primary productivity when the um, solar energy is captured in the form of of plant biomass and that supplies the whole food system the whole ecosystem from the the microbes in the soil to animals that uh, chew on leaves it all uh, starts with photosynthesis photosynthesis is uh, taking the the water cycle so sunlight's driving the water cycle which is fixing the energy and and the photosynthesis itself is measured as gross primary productivity and almost half of the energy that the plants uh, capture in photosynthesis is used by the plants to uh, maintain and to grow new biomass and then at the end of the season um, the leaves drop and some of the small branches or crops are, are harvested and decomposition happens so that's um, that's energy by the microbes that are decomposing the plant biomass. That's heterotrophic respiration and much of the carbon in the carbon cycle is, is released to the atmosphere. So there's a little bit left over, a few percent left over and, and what's left is called net ecosystem productivity and that um, accumulates each year and that's drawing down some of our pollution in the atmosphere and, and restoring uh, a balance unless uh, disturbance, pests, or fires uh, also release that, uh, that biomass, that uh, productivity. And what's left at the end is the net biome productivity. So that's the way uh, the Earth system regulates energy from the sun uh, through the water cycle and the carbon cycle, and it's very important in this living planet.